हेलो एवरी वन नाउ लेट सी हाउ वी विल सॉल्व दिस टाइप ऑफ क्वेश्चन द क्वेश्चन इज स्क्वेर रूट ऑफ फाइव प्लस स्क्वेर रूट ऑफ फाइव माइनस एक्स अपॉन स्क्वेर रूट ऑफ फाइव माइनस स्क्वेर रूट ऑफ फाइव माइनस एक्स इक्वल्स टू थ्री सो दिस होल पार्ट इज इक्वल टू थ्री सो दिस पार्ट इज गिवन टू अस एंड वी नीड टू फाइंड आउट द वैल्यू ऑफ एक्स वॉट विल बी द वैल्यू ऑफ x for this equation so x equal to question mark so this we will find out options which are given to us are 2 upon 4 15 upon 2 15 upon 4 and 4 upon 15 so these are the four options which are given to us so let us solve and see which option is correct okay so moving ahead with the solution part so first of all this part is given to us square root of 5 प्लस स्क्वेर रूट ऑफ फाइव माइनस एक्स अपॉन स्क्वेर रूट ऑफ फाइव माइनस स्क्वेर रूट ऑफ फाइव माइनस एक्स एंड दिस इज इक्वल टू थ्री नाउ इफ यू सी फाइव माइनस एक्स फाइव माइनस एक्स दिस स्क्वेर रूट ऑफ फाइव माइनस एस फाइव माइनस एक्स इज गिवन हियर ऑल्सो एंड हियर ऑल्सो सो लेट्स एज्यूम इट एज यू सो लेट एस सपोज दैट स्क्वेर रूट ऑफ फाइव माइनस एक्स इज इक्वल टू यू सो इन प्लेस ऑफ दिस स्क्वेर रूट ऑफ फाइव माइनस एक्स वी विल कीप यू टू मेक इट सिंपल ओके टू मेक इट ईजी सो दिस स्क्वेर रूट ऑफ फाइव माइनस एक्स आई एम सपोजिंग दिस आई एम एज्यूमिंग दिस एज यू यू कैन टेक इट एज एक्स और एनी वेरिएबल विच एवर यू लाइक सो आई हैव टेकन यू ओके सो वॉट आई विल गेट रूट फाइव Plus now in place of this square root of five minus x, I will keep u because I have taken it as u, so I am keeping u. Same way in the denominator, I will keep square root of five minus u, and this side equals to three. Now this term denominator I will shift here and it will be multiplied here with three. So what I will get is square root of five plus u is equal to three into bracket square root of Phi minus u. Okay, so now we will open up the bracket. This three we will multiply here with both three into root phi and three into this minus u. So what I will get is square root of phi plus u equals to three square root of phi minus three u. Three into u is three u. Now this minus three u I will shift here, so it will become positive. Okay, transposing the terms. so what i am doing is this minus 3u i am keeping like terms together so here already u is there so this minus 3u i am shifting here so it will become plus 3u sorry it will become plus 3u equals to this side 3 root 5 is there now this root 5 i will shift that side so it will become minus root 5 okay so here u plus 3u and this side 3 root 5 minus root 5 this root 5 is positive so this i am shifting there so it will become negative so what we will get here u plus 3u will be 4u so the answer of this will be 4u and this side 3 root 5 minus 1 times root 5 will give us 2 root 5 now this 4 i will shift here in the denominator so u will be equal to 2 root 5 upon 4 now cancellation is possible so we can do cancellation so here Two ones are okay. So let me show it with this. So here two ones are and here two twos are. So this way we can cancel. So what I am getting square root of five upon two. So now this is the value of u. So I am getting u equals to square root of five upon two. So we have got u, but we need to find out x. Okay. So now again, what I am doing is. What was our u? U we have already assumed as square root of five minus x. Now we are substituting back its original value. So in place of u, we will keep square root of five minus x. Okay, equals to square root of five upon two. So what I have done now in place of u, I am keeping square root of five minus x. Now to remove this square root, what we will do? We will do square, squaring both the sides. Okay, squaring both the sides. So both the sides we will square. So I am showing the calculation part here. Okay, so this side I was having square root of five minus x. This is whole under the root, 
and this side I have square root of 5 upon 2. As I told you, we will do squaring both the sides. So, here also we will square up and here also we will square up. So, when you do squaring both the sides, here the root gets removed with this square. So, we are getting only 5 minus x and here we are getting, uh, this root is also removed. So, we are getting 5 upon this 2, you will square up. Okay, this square is for both numerator and denominator. So, square root of 5 is uh, 5. Okay, so square of square root of 5 is 5 and square root of 2 will give us 4. So, I am getting 5 upon 4. Now, further this 4 will be multiplied here. Okay, 4 will be multiplied here. So, uh, after here I am solving here. So, I will get 4 into bracket 5 minus x equals to 5. So, what I have done? I got u. I have kept back the value of u. I have done squaring both the sides. I have got this. Now, I am uh, showing the calculation part here. Okay. So, 4 into 5 minus x equals to 5. So, if you multiply 4 5 za, 4 5 za is 20 minus 4 into x is 4x equals to 5. Now, this minus 4x, I am taking that side, shifting that side, transposing on RHS. Okay. And this positive 5, I am taking here. So, it will become negative 5. So, 20 minus 5 equal to 4x. So, 20 minus 5 is 15. So, 15 equal to 4x. Now, this 4, we will shift here in the denominator. So, x will be equal to 15 upon 4. So, 15 upon 4 is equal to x or x is equal to 15 upon 4. So, this will be our final answer. So, we got the value of x. So, this is the value of x. I hope you understood. First, uh, these are the steps. Then, these are the steps. Then, here two steps and then we have continued here. So, 15 upon 4 is the correct answer. If you check out the option C, option C shows the correct answer. So, this one, C1 will be the correct answer for this type of question. I hope you understood.